Hey guys, this is Neil for Ace Up Golf, and you guys all know that the the Supreme drop yesterday was a complete disaster for basically everyone, especially bot users. I mean, not bot users, autofill users. Um, everyone in comment sections of live cop videos are saying their autofill doesn't work, and if you don't know what I'm talking about, I'll show you. So you go, you try checking out, and basically you can see the autofill does not fill up, and you can't. Even you don't even have the option to click on this the autofill and change it and generate new autofill rules or anything like that. Uh, if you have a bot, you're good. You could just use uh, the autofill function on that. Like I'm gonna use I use Force Cop autofill. I still manually check out. I just use it for the autofill. But if you don't want to fork over the money for that, and uh, if you don't want to have to just use the Supreme autofill, which doesn't fill in the credit card number or anything like that. Uh, there is a way around it, so let me show you. Basically, all you have to do, you have to create a new person. This basically is just like a completely new uh, Chrome window that doesn't record any of the information you have. You have to sign in, you can see. So that's what I'm going to do. Don't switch. Okay, so basically go to Chrome Web Store. Then you're just gonna get autofill again. Alright, so add extension and sign in. Make sure you sign in. Okay, that, that's important. Or else it won't work. I don't know why, but that's just how it is. So you're gonna have to sign in again. Okay, don't switch. Then go to Supreme. So we're basically going to be setting up autofill rules again. So if you don't know how to do that, just uh, view all. Or that's not necessary, but then add something to cart, check out. Don't do it for real though. And then look, you have the option to click on it. Create new rules. So Supreme. And then basically you can just proceed to fill in information. I'm just going to make up something random. Okay, at this point you can just go ahead and generate auto full rules. Pretty standard, you guys know how about that. So, now here's the real test. So I'm just going to empty this cart. Okay, and then I'm going to go Supreme again. And test it out to see if it still works. So shop. If you all check out. Yada, yada, yada. And boom, as you can see, it filled in everything. And you still have the option to go in and edit thing edit this and all that jazz so it works um my theory behind why this works is by creating a new user person per se you basically off supreme's radar um if you go on your normal account window basically supreme and if have you bought from supreme before they basically have all your info and then they use that to uh, as a way to block autofill. When you create a new person, they don't have any info on you. So for whatever reason, you can use the autofill. Um, I do think that after uh, you check out once and actually buy something, you'll likely have to delete the person and create a, a completely new one because you know Supreme has the info. Uh, but this is just a way to get around that now it it is it is more tedious and basically uh, I, it might not be worth it for some of you guys you could just use the supreme autofill and then just copy and paste your credit card info and do all this but this is a way to save maybe a few seconds and uh, increase your chances of being successful so uh, I hope this helped you guys out and uh, uh, Supreme might find a way to change this, but 
until then it'll work and uh, if it doesn't work then I'll, I'll try and make a new video and find another way around it but I hope this helped you guys out and thank you for watching